Inspector General of Police Ibrahim Idris has flagged off the Nigeria Police Force Public Relations School in conjunction with the Nigerian Institute of Public Relations Nigerian Policing Program and Summit Leadership Institute. The force will also launch the Community Policing Strategy Initiative in a few weeks, which is aimed at entrenching professionalism in public relations and practice in the force. Anita Patrick tells us more in this report. The Nigerian Police Force is setting a new milestone through the establishment of policing structures to meet international policing practice and ensure an abundant polled qualified candidate who possesses personal attributes and skill-based formal training to give the force a good reputation. Put it in the front banner so that all of us from this lowest rank to the highest rank will take it very, very seriously. And I believe this training you are attending today is one of the issues that some of you should take seriously in our efforts to polish the image of the police force. Professionalism and transformation of the force has been advocated for as a sustainable plan to put its activities in a good light before the Nigerians and the international community. Officers will pass through managing the social media, which happens to be the main media actually in Nigeria now because almost everybody is a communist man. There will be Commending the Inspector General of Police for bringing to stay the force public relations school in the force, experts hail the training as core to enhance a proactive police force. The Nigerian policemen all over the world where they have served ever will come with good results and good name and good image. Why not at home? We must find out here. Then every individual is a building block to the image the Nigerian police has, because reputation is gradient. The training is expected to reawaken the officers and involve community members and other professionals in assisting the Nigerian police in dealing with community issues. Aniete Patrick, Co. TV News, Abuja.